What's going on guys? It's your boy Mac is life. And today we're going to be looking at another video from the homie Tut. This is job interviews in the hood by him and Devonte the one. Now if you're new, be sure to subscribe. Click on that bell so that you'll know. Let's dive into this skit. So further ado, let's Yeah. We doing moves over here. Okay. You see me out here in these streets. In these streets. Old fish. What y'all do today? I bet streets, you wasn't no fish okay. in the sea. <laughs> Enough gloating though. Let me get to the purpose on why y'all are here. So lately, my folks been on my fin about making some bread. Why is it every time I see you, you using up my air? That air ain't free, nigga. I did not raise a bum. Get up and get a job. So I applied at the most convenient spot where the food is crap, the service is rude, and more importantly, they don't do drug tests. <laughs> What? She pregnant too? Don't do drugs, yeah, kids. Yeah, she's not getting unfollowed. It's over with. I don't want to see her family grow up. It's supposed to be me. Mine is the baby. I think I miss Sandy. I kind of miss the way she used to take them strong biceps, wrap them around my neck, and just... Oh, dude, oh, oh, oh. What's... Hey, yo. Yo. Come on, peanut butter. Get off your Reese's phone, cup. Right? Reese's cup. Reese's cup. Peanut butter chocolate flake. You can't be... What you doing? Him? What you doing, bro? What you doing? What you doing? Get out of my ear with that. <laughs> Sneaking up on me like that. Uh, my bad. Uh, uh, welcome to the Krusty Krab, where the food is served by a middle-aged virgin sponge man, and the lobby is clean every other week. What can I get for you? Uh, I'm actually here for an interview. I know I'm a little late, but I can see you had your focus on something else. I was antagonized by this flat-headed, ugly dude who probably ain't brushed his teeth in a century. Mm -hmm. Huh? Huh? Hey, hold on. What that was? Y'all heard it? Y'all heard that view? Yeah, it's called, heard a, it? it's called a narrator. Here, it's cool. I know I'm high, but hey, sound like. Okay, nah, it was, it was nothing. I could have sworn I just heard a, like a voiceover, mm -hmm. but it sounded like you too. Anyways, uh, boss man ain't here right now, so I'm gonna have to give you your interview. Ah, <laughs> switch the switch it up just I'm like. Take a seat, young blood. I'm uh, come holler at you a little bit. Six and a half hours later. Hey man, you need to bounce with it. You ain't gotta go home. But you can't stay here. Yeah, I man, huh? I swear. What? Tutting his Get out of here, man. This ain't no shelter. I love him, man. String they cheese body funny. boy. <laughs> you, you like the type to eat mayonnaise. Just straight out the jar. Like, yeah. You don't even put it on a sandwich or nothing. You just, ooh, it's time for my treat. It's nasty. This nigga had the audacity to step up to me like this? Y'all know I wasn't going down like that. Hey, 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 chill out. <laughs> Is that you? The voice sound like you, man. Oh, you that, oh. <laughs> You the dude who came in for the interview. That's crazy. Well, My bad, man. Obviously, me... bro. Woo! Yeah, and again cool with man. the switch up. Okay. All right, Playboy, let's get this started. You ever worked for fast food before? Some places here and there. Ah, uh-huh. I see. Next question. You ever Millie Rock on the block? Excuse me? Dwight. You deaf or something? I said, have you ever Millie Rock, Rock on, the on the block? Like the dance? <laughs> you already answered that question wrong, bro. Next question, uh... You and your partners, you, you and your homeboys, you know what I'm saying? Pull up to the club as soon as you walk in. Bro, what? Let me tell you something, Playboy. Don't interrupt me again, Reese's <laughs> peanut butter flavor. He just smacked huh? him. People get put six feet over for saying stuff like that. All right? You want to be swimming with the humans? Well, shut up. Like I was saying, you and your homeboys pull up to the club as soon as you walk in some busters step on your brand new Finn Jordan Air Maxis. Oh, uh, that's disrespect. What you gonna do? I don't wear shoes, crazy man. I'm a fish. Hypothetically, nigga. I don't know. I guess catch a fade. Word. I respect that. Oh, uh, cool, cool, cool. Hmm. Next question. You got two George Washingtons to your name. And he got the nerve to be to be stunting with a, uh, 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 with a diamond encrusted iPhone case. Who is you? <laughs> What's for dinner? A cup of noodles. Ah, right you is. Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. Next question. Uh, what's rule number four? That's on fake. He out here According capping. According to Biggie and the <laughs> crack commandments. Number four. Know you heard this before. Never get high on your own supply. Yeah, yeah. That's my boy. That's my boy. That's what's up. That's smart. Next question. Uh, what's the state capital of Hawaii? Bro, what? State capital Hawaii, nigga. What is it? Was this dude for real? I was starting to think. Nigga, stop. I know that's you somehow commenting on your own life as if you telling a story to somebody. All right? And I know you're talking to the viewers. You? I figured it out. Huh? Now answer the question. Stop doing this telepathic psychopath 
comment over the story in Moesha Diaries. Come on, man, answer the question. Honolulu, dang. Okay, there we go. There we go. You doing good, young blood. Just one more question. Okay. What you think about that whole lot of red album? It freaking sucked, bruh. What'd you just say? Ooh. It was hype, man, but it sucked. Uh, you right, but I gotta go on here and get on your ass. You know what I'm saying? Get your fries for dreads. I almost dip your dreads in some ketchup, boy. I bet you listen to Drake, don't it? Kiki, do you love me? Every morning you start off listening to Drake while you brush your mouth. <laughs> What? <laughs> you know, Tuck like just saying anything, bro. Cottage cheese on a hot date. I feel day. like, like, like he'd be reading the script, but it seems like he'd be winging it at the same time, bro. That's my, don't like. ever come back. And don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more. <laughs> he, he gonna you know, like, go. You sing that at karaoke whenever they tell you, pick your song. Hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more. Man, this man gonna come to my whole temple and say a whole lot of red was garbage. Right. Uh, he was right. But he look, I ain't pull out the heater and go ahead and get his ass up out of here. Hey. And I'm just kidding, Drake. You know I love you. I'm trying to uh you trying to jump in and you know, jump in one At this point he's kinda of talking to himself to right now. Uh you trying to uh you know what I'm saying? It'll make my day. No? Okay, cool. I mean that's fine, that's fine. That's, that work, that work. Hey, if you watch this video all the way through to the end, that means you rock with your boy. And I, I want to appreciate y'all for rocking with your boy. You know what I'm saying? I want to make sure I got a hope. All right, so I got to stop you right there, bro. I appreciate you and everything that you do, bro. All the work you've done in the past years, making everybody laugh. I appreciate you, my boy. But, yo, this video right here, I give it a five all day. The concept was just there. It's like... I, I, I remember, you know what I'm saying, I worked a few jobs, I worked a few minimum minimum wage jobs in, in the past, and they be asking me all these boo boo the fool questions, <laughs> but that, that was basically the moral of it going on like that, but uh, this was a pretty good skit from from the homie Tuck Weezy, but yeah, that'll be all for today, guys, hope y'all enjoyed that, give this video a like, share with your friends, do what you gotta do, but until then, catch y'all later.